what's the worst you've been called in politics? I don't know if I can say it's worst because I, I don't think it really got to me. I've been called a prostitute. I, I, I was having this interview and this, um, I will not mention his name. Um, an honorable member said, oh, oh, person, they wanted him to withdraw. Then I said, mm -mm, don't let him withdraw. Let him carry on. Oh, no, but I said, yeah, let him, let him carry on. So on TV? The, it was radio. It was radio. And so he was on the other side of the mm -hmm. phone. I was on the other side. I said, okay. So he finished. He continued. Then I said, no, he shouldn't withdraw. So when he finished and I was given the opportunity, I actually had to, I discussed whatever I wanted to say on the table. And then I had some time, so I asked the host, do you know why I didn't want him to withdraw? I said, yeah, it's true. I'm a prostitute, yes, it's true. And he knows because I work with his mom. So how can you not tell the gentleman whose mom is my colleague? And he's actually telling you my job. And you're saying he should withdraw. I said, yes, I work with his mom. His sisters are also professional prostitutes because the mother trained them. Your wife is a professional prostitute. And your child, who is being trained by your wife, is a potential one. So it's my job. Then I asked, so I said, the only difference between me and his mom is that I give birth to wise children, but the mother gave birth to a fool like him. So you have a sharp teeth? No. When you are talking to me as a woman and you call me a prostitute, what do you want me to say to you? I should cry? No, you have a mom. No woman, no child came out of a tree. You have a mother, you have a wife, you have a sister, you have a daughter. So I should cry? It will not get to me. But I 